Dallas, y'all, people. We are here at Silver Dollar City. I got my ticket in my hand. I'm waiting for my parents to get out of the bathroom. And I'm so excited. They already have the lights on, which is amazing. But we'll see how this camera goes with it. I walked up here because I needed to go to the bathroom. But that's why my hair is all crazy now. Oh, you can hear the train. Oh, snap. You can hear the train. Look, even in the ticket booth, they have the Christmas lights. Okay, so I didn't record on the flooded mine mainly because there's a lot of water in new camera. No, not doing any of that. Anyway, so we're in line for the train now. It's a long line, but it's a really fast train, so hopefully we'll be able to get through before somebody goes a little berserk. Christmas kids. <laughs> it sure is good to see you. Oh well, yeah, Grandma and I have been expecting it. She's up there in the cabin right now working out the menu for our Thanksgiving dinner. 
and I could hardly wait. <laughs> I love this time of year. Well, the holiday season. Thanksgiving will be here before you know it, and you know what that means. Christmas is just around the corner. Oh, that's my favorite time. It's a time when friends and family come home, people are getting together to go places, and well, everybody just seems friendlier and happier. I do wish we could be that way all the time. Well, we could, you know. A long time ago, there lived a man that taught us how to feel that kind of spirit all the time. Well, he was a special man that lived a special life, and he died a special death. Many wondrous things happened to that man, but I think the most wondrous was his birth. I'd like to tell you kids it's a story about the night that he was born. in the cabin now for Grandma's cook fire. You probably ought to get back to town before you miss something. I sure am glad you made it home this year. I hope everyone can. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas, Grandpa. Thank you for your wonderful gift. You're welcome. Bye-bye now. Bye, kids. Bye-bye now. Bye, kids. Thanks for coming tonight.
put a million and I think it's a million and a half likes in here. They mean it. They really do. There we go. Even though we did the train in the morning instead of at night, you can go see my other video, which I'm going to put down below, of it at night. Granted, it is with my iPhone, but it's okay because uh, you can still see a lot of stuff. So, and that one also has um, a lot of the lights at dark too. But I'm really going to tell you, this tree is working it right now. This is amazing. But anyway, so that is it. Oh snap, I need to record this. Done with me. I know. The tree wasn't in the way though. Huh? Okay, so I am now back from Silver Dollar City, uh, went to church, went to go out to eat with my lovely husband who is in the other room right now. And this is what I got. So I've been drinking this one because I wanted, really wanted to try it. I have no clue how to say it. Muscadine? That's what I'm going to go with. But I really don't know. And I don't, I haven't looked it up or anything. But it kind of tastes like communion, communion juice, to <laughs> be completely honest. So this is what this is. I don't know if that's going to focus or not, but got that one. So that one's really good. It's very, very sugary though. Keep in mind, very sugary. And then the other one is, of course, my favorite, blackberry cider. Oh, I love blackberries. And... That I'm not even kidding. Out of that, I got the ice cream cone, which you saw in the video, and that is it. That's all I bought there. That is it. Nothing else. Because I ate beforehand and then ate after, too. But I'm going to sit here and drink my communion juice. <laughs> 